Oh, beautiful people. Do I look good? Probably not. Probably not. I was about to do my makeup and then somebody called me on FaceTime and then I was just like, huh? I had my glasses on and everything and I was like, hello? And it was like one of my internet friends who I've never met and they've never like seen me like, like that. So, um... I was like, shoot, um, sorry I answered like this, but anyway, my bangs are always, I need to, I need to freaking cut them, like, I know in the last video, that's what I was saying, I said, like, I need to cut my bangs, and that might have been two videos ago, so now we're two videos past me wanting to cut my bangs. I finally cut them, just now, I just cut them, doesn't look that different, but it feels different, and it makes a difference to me, in my heart, in my soul. So, also, I'd like to point out, uh, in this video, sorry, my, I have eyeliner, <laughs> I would like to point out that in this video, um, my skin looks really bad, and I also, um, have mascara, like, on my eyelid, I was a mess, so, just letting you know that I'm aware, you don't have to clock me for it, I'm clocking myself for it, so, here I am getting lip gloss stuck in my hair. Anyway, let's just address the pimple on my cheek. It's cute, she looks like a beauty mark. So today, I got um, my ColourPop package in the mail with a bunch of lip products that I ordered. Jazz, why would you order so much lipstick? You already have a whole freaking collection of lipstick, but I thought, you know what? Why not be more relevant? Um, this is relevant. All my lip products are so old now um, that if I tag the brands, uh, they're not going to, you know, these are all like discontinued products that I've been using. So it's just like, girl, I need, that's Bay. that's Bay who just snapchatted me. I put that emoji because he's so hot. <laughs> I haven't ordered makeup in this entire year. I've been living off of the makeup that I've just had because, you know, I'm not going to run out of that. But um, if I want to be relevant in the beauty community, I got to step up my game and uh, use some new products so that they can promote me and I can promote them and everything. That's how the beauty industry works. Um, oh, I got an ultra, ultra blotted lip. I got a lip crayon the tinted lip crayon i've never tried their ultra blotted lips or their lip crayons before i i have a little collection of their this is my favorite lip color of all time echo park this is the third tube that i've bought because um i love their stuff so much so so i tried their um ultra satin lips um and then i also got two of their lip glosses isn't the packaging so cute, so juicy, so cute? Like, I just want to, like, um, I was also a package designer at school. Like, every everyone knows, like, I did freaking everything at art school, okay? So, I really admire package design. And so, I got another, I got an ultra glossy lip and another ultra glossy lip. Um, I think I want to try the lip crayon first. Do I look ugly now? I can't even see if I look ugly. Here she is. I'm unboxing these for the first time. Um, this is the Just a Tint. Just a Tint. What am I saying? Do I have an accent? I don't know. This one is called Z-Boys. Um, should be called E-Boys. <laughs> am I right? No, probably not. Jeez. Okay, that just messed me up. Okay. Ooh. Ugh. It smells... It smells like, like high chews, like mango high chews or something. Anyway, here it is. Ooh, I like this. This is a really nice peachy kind of lip color. It smells good. It doesn't taste like anything. I really like this. I can even see myself pairing this with some lip liner as well. Or if I just want to go for that like no makeup, makeup look, I just go to this. It's like lip balm kind of. I've been, lately I've just been shearing down some lipstick and then putting lip gloss over it, but this is like 
this is like what I've wanted to wear lately. Like I like just a little bit of something on my lips. Like I don't, I'm not trying to go for that crisp lipstick look all the time. So, um, yeah, I, I don't know how long, uh, the wear is for this lip color, but I like it. So I almost don't want to take it off, but you know, I'll wear it soon. I feel like sometimes like there's just not enough days for me to wear lipstick. So in the middle of the day, I'll like switch to another lipstick because I have too many lipsticks to just, you know, go through. I'm going to go on to these, the juicy, the so juicy lip, lip glosses. Ooh, I don't even have a clear lip gloss. Like that's in a tube. I've always wanted a clear lip gloss in a tube. I have uh, a clear lips lip gloss in like this kind of tube. I, I like the squeezy tube so I can just like, you know, you know what I'm saying? I can't get enough out. Like I have to keep dipping in and dipping in and like being like, but this, it's like, I can just squeeze the entire thing all over my face. Cause that's what I want. Yes. That is it. It's supposed to be a plumping gloss. Ooh, and it smells so minty. Ooh. Ooh. She thick. She cute. I like her. This is, yeah, this is nice. Um, and it's, it smells, she smells like mint. She smells like peppermint. I'm trying to figure out if she tastes good too. She kind of does. So I would probably recommend this if you are, if you want to smell minty. This one is called Princess Cut. It's just the plain old clear one. Here is the pink one. This one is called Make It Savvy. Ooh, she's pretty. I'm talking about the gloss. I'm not calling myself pretty. I'm stunning, I know. I like these because I love the squeezy tube. You can just squeeze out all you want. You can make your lips thick with this. Like, oh, it's so good. The next one I'm gonna do is Space Maker. I remember she's like a pink, like a light, lighter pink gloss nude almost ooh ooh i know i'm gonna like her watch me not like her um so yeah this is space maker ooh oh my gosh oh my <gasps> she like a little paintbrush and she smells like crumb roulette i'm gonna carry this around with me just so i can smell her dang this is a creamy gloss okay This is cute. I feel like I would need a lip liner for this. Why does this look so orange? Peach. In real life, it looks cute. But on camera, I'm like, girl, you need to line your lips. Because this is, looks like I uh, ate like a dead pumpkin or something. But, uh, what the? It looks different. It looks so different on camera. I do not, I do not understand. But, She's cute in person. Um, oh my god. I'm trying to decide if I like it on camera. I like it in real life. It's very, it's like peachy, kind of pink in real life. And then on camera, it's like orange. I like her. I, I would just do, I would use lip liner next time. This one is supposed to be darker. I swear this is not the same one. This is the one I just tried and then this is the, the one I'm about to try. <laughs> They look the same, but I swear they're different. I will even swatch them on my hand so that you can see the difference. This one's supposed to be darker. See, look, it's way darker. I don't know why I'm like such a psychopath right now and have my ringer on. Oh, it was because I was walking my dog earlier and I had music in. I had my um, earphones in and I needed to hear if people were texting me. Um... Anyway, man, it smells so good. It smells like caramel almost. Like vanilla caramel. These are very pigmented glosses. Like these are the most pigmented glosses I've ever tried on. Like you just swipe it and it's like cream. Like it's still a gloss, but it looks creamy. Mm. This is really pretty. I really like this. It's kind of like pumpkin, pumpkin-y, but like brown pumpkin. <laughs> I don't know. Looks like a pumpkin spice latte if I've ever seen one. Yeah, so this one's called Lesson Learned. Um, 
again, it's showing up more orange on camera. Like, it looks more yellow on camera, but it's more like a nude um, brown, kind of. I, I like it though. Here, let me swatch them on my hand. There, that's the one I'm wearing now. And then Space Maker is the previous one I was wearing. So they look kind of similar, but they are pretty different. Like this one is more pink, and then this one is more like pumpkin spice latte. PSL season. I have one more lip product to try. Okay, this is the last one, and it is called... Dang, she already saying, put me on your lips, okay? And this is called Scenic Root, and this is an ultra blotted lip, so it's not supposed to be a full-on lipstick. It's supposed to kind of be like a lip stain, like a sheer type of lip stain. So let's see what she has to offer. I'm going to swatch her on my hand first to kind of just see what the product is like. It's kind of, it's creamy, but it's thin. This is so cute. Kind of like that powdery lip effect. And it feels good on the lips too. I was afraid that this was going to be too drying. Like I know that this is supposed to kind of dry down. Um, and I just didn't want it to like cling to my lips and like look all dry. You know, like when you put on a dry liquid lipstick and then you smile and then the lipstick kind of like cracks and you feel like your lips are just busting into a million pieces. Like... That's how the Kylie uh, lipsticks are. Like, I don't know how they've lasted that long, like, being sold. I think because Kylie Jenner's name is on it, that's why. But, I mean, I think she did reformulate her colors and stuff. But my sister got one, and it, like, like, if I wanted to wear that lipstick, I would not be able to, like, smile. I would just be like, <laughs> And you know me, I'm a smiley girl. Like, I always got the smile lines going on like my foundation if I well I don't wear fa foundation anymore but my makeup will like crease right here sometimes if I am smiling so much which I love to do uh wow I really like this um this would go really well with lip gloss on top of it so I'm gonna put this clear lip gloss on top of it because that's actually what I intended to do when I bought this I wanted to kind of just have that light wash of color and then put a lip gloss on top of it um and then also like you know wanted just a lip gloss with color so let's see yes i really like the kind of blushy lip effect like sometimes i will just put lip balm on and then put blush on top of it um but then it kind of dries out my lips but then this gives that same effect um, again, this is called Scenic Root. It gives that same effect. And um, with the lip gloss, I really like their lip gloss. And it doesn't like tingle hard um, like a lot of other plumping glosses do. Miss Too Faced here will hurt you. Like you do not want to put this anywhere else besides your lips because she will hurt you. She like, one time I actually smeared it like on my cheek and my cheek turned red. And I was like, girl, I don't want to plump up my random part of my cheek like what the heck i just ran my hands through my hair with my lip gloss still on and my lip gloss got into my hair so i should be smarter about this and not do that my bangs are a problem they're a problem but they're they're a cute problem they're a cute problem to have this video is probably really long now and i apologize i didn't mean I didn't know what I was doing. Man, I really hope this pimple goes away. <laughs> oh my god, I looked like an actual baby when I did that. Thanks for watching this video. Sorry, I was, I'm like, ooh. My bangs like look so weird. I was, I was just on a walk earlier with Cookie and it was so hot outside and I was like so sweaty and I didn't have any makeup on so I came home and did my makeup just so I can um, make this uh, lip gloss try on video. And I wanted to show off my new e-boy jeans. I'm such an e-boy and also this is my dad's shirt but he gave it to me. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Lend me, lend me a good old subscribe. That's 
that's uh that's what you should do uh, ooh. leave me a comment all about your life no i'm kidding i don't know i'm like trying to be like drew monson who always says leave me a comment at the end of your videos so Thank you.